Hi! Today I'm going to show you a super simple way to print a dragonfly. So we're going to draw the dragonfly first and then we're going to print it using um, really basic stuff which is why this is so cool. Um, you're going to use a plastic bag and a marker. That's it. Alright, you ready to go? I'm so ready to go. Alright, let's make a dragonfly. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to do the head. So the head is a curve like this. Here. It's like a C. And then we're going to make another curve behind it. So that's going to start for the body, but there you go. Just a little curve like that. Now I'm going to break this in half. And then I'm going to do two lines that are curved like this. So I have one here coming down like that. And one there coming down like that. You got it? Good. The next thing we're going to do is the body. Now the body is just a big U shape. So you're going to go down and up. So you've got your head. You have your thorax. Now I need our abdomen. The only thing that abdomen is not totally like another U. It goes out. So from here, you're going to go out this way, out that way, and then you're just going to connect it with a big U. So now you have your whole body, and now we're just missing the wings. So for the wings, they come from here, this part of the body, the thorax. So you're going to go out like this. I'm going to do another one on the other side. I'm going to turn my paper because it just makes it easier for me. We're going to do two back here. So it's one here. And another one this way. Alright, now what we're going to do is the little wingy part. Now it looks like sticks now. <laughs> Turn them to wings. Uh, so we're going to go in like that. And I'm going, I work like to work back and forth. Uh, it tends out to be a little more symmetrical if I do it that way. Then I just kind of do one whole wing. And then the other. And then I'm going to do the same one here. And this one I'm going to go a little bit out. And then in. And same thing on the side you can do it in. A little bit out, it's up to you. Alright, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to finish right there and right there. And you have a dragonfly. You're going to judge that a little bit there. Alright, that is it. If you wanted to, you could, well, let's add a little more. You could add a few stripes this way. Like that. Cool. And we are going to now do the print. So for the print, all you have to do is find something you want to print on. I'm going to print on an envelope. Um, I recommend thin paper. The thinner the paper, the better it comes out. And then you're going to take your drawing. I have a few papers here just in case I mess up. And I'm going to put it into my envelope. My envelope. I'm going to put it into a Ziploc bag. Sorry about that. <laughs> now, on my Ziploc bag, I have my drawing here. Now I'm going to take my regular marker. Um, you don't want a permanent. You don't want a sharpie because it won't work. Um, and you're just going to trace over what you already have with your regular marker. Okay, so I traced over it, and what I would do is take my regular piece of paper. I'm going to think about where I want to put, place it because I don't. You get like one chance really on this one. So I think I'm going to do it over here. And I'm going to press down, um, <laughs> hard. And then I'm going to lift it up, and I have a little dragonfly pen. Isn't that cool? I love it. Um, well, I hope you do too. And you can make lots of them and put them all over, which is the fun of the print. Um, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.